welcome back to my channel. It's Theoni with Thrifty Divas, and we're here with what I think is a giant Dollar Tree haul. You know I never have any clue. We find out together. Uh, it should have been two videos, but then time just got away from me, and now, yeah, we're just doing one. It's probably going to be huge, and because of that, for the sake of saving time, we're not going to break it down into category this time around. We're just going to pull and grab. So uh, yeah, without further ado, let's jump right in. All right, the first thing we have are these 12 ounce bottles of Otoban air freshener, not disinfectant, right? Not like the little ones, just air freshener. This is in the cherry. Now, this was the only one I saw at first, but if you watch the walkthrough, I find another one later and it's in here. And I feel like it might smell stronger. I'm not really sure yet. They smell really mild. But in any case, got it. Made in the USA. Then I got a bottle of Green Apple Jones's Soda for St. Patrick's Day. Then I got this Be Pure Hydrating Under Eye Concealer. It is 0 0.4 fluid ounces. This one is in the medium. We'll see how that goes. Oh, so in case you didn't know, so it's hydrating. It says it has hyaluronic acid and that you get the benefits of an eye cream and a concealer all in one. So it makes pretty large claims. Then I got two of these Be Pure Tinted Rose Oil Lip Balm. So this changes color. It says goes from clear to your unique lip color a pH thing, and you're going to get something in there. But I got one for me, and then I got one for a gift for my aunt that lives in Greece to give to her this summer. Let's see. Let's see what happens to me. It's really pretty. I love the rose gold. I love it. And it's totally, like, clear. I should have only done one lip. Oh, it smells like rose oil. That's fantastic. Oh, mine's getting dark. But it's supposed to be your perfect thing. I like it. Okay, awesome. It's pretty fascinating. All right, moving on. Then I found one of these in the makeup aisle thrown on top of a whole bunch of... I don't even know what it was. Look at... It's a metal pig. I love it. I don't know where it came from. I, I, I have never in any of my stores seen anything that goes along with this or anything. But it says wall decor. And I love this little piggy. It is absolutely amazing. And that's going to get hung in the kitchen. Then I got these. These contoured eye masks. So they had purple, dark blue, and black, I believe, at my store. So I got the black one for my stepfather because my mom and my stepdad are going on vacation in a couple weeks. So I thought maybe he could have that for the plane or even the hotel. He's the most light-sensitive person I've ever encountered in my life. I, I, I've said it before in videos. He puts electrical tape over, like, the cable box and stuff to sleep. So I thought that would be good for him. And the purple one for me, and this is really cool. Like, it won't mess up your makeup or if you wear falsies and things like that because it's contoured. Looks like a little bra, <laughs> but I love it. I got some more Scooby Snacks for Little Man. I got some green things for St. Patrick's Day. I'm switching it up a little bit. I got, like, this lime green and this lime green cutlery, but then I also got the classic green tablecloth. I don't know, but I won't be needing to search from green stuff. I am starting to get Easter stuff for everyone because it's in front of me. So I got two packs of these, four packs of the Reese's eggs, one for my husband, one for my stepfather, and then same one for hubs, one for stepfather, these Reese's eggs bags. I got a pack of 30 disinfecting wipes by All Clear. Um, Brett and I are going on a little uh, long weekend vacation, uh, first week in April. So I just wanted to bring that with us. And then I got this for Little Man's Easter Basket. This is 
Uh, Mr. Potato Head Magnetic Activity Set includes one scene and five magnet sheets. I'm sorry, two. I was reading that backwards. <laughs> two magnet sheets. And there's the little potato on the beach in a metal tin. So that'll go in his Easter basket. Then I got this. So this is Kendall and Kylie, but I got this for little man. I thought it was totally fine for a boy. And I thought it would be super cute in Greece uh, for him to carry around stuff in. So it's a, you know, little, little backpack and it has little anchors on it. And of course it says Kendall and Kylie on it. But I thought that was really cute and it's little man size, you know? But I thought that would be perfect for all of our outings. Oh, and I think we're also planning on taking a ferry to another island uh, for a couple of days while we're there this time. So this will be perfect for him. And no, Brett is not coming again this summer. We said next, we're gonna aim for next summer, but it's just, it's very hard. I can work remotely, my mother can work remotely, Brett can't work remotely, so not only does it cost a lot to go there, but then you're missing out on a lot, because we stay for a long time. So anyway, but yeah, so he's probably not coming again this year. Nothing scandalous though, don't worry. Then, so they had a like a lime green one in this as well, but I got these two water bottle things. I got the black and I got the blue. They look like little Game Boys. So little man got invited to a birthday party in a, in a couple day, a couple weeks or something. Yeah, a couple weeks. And um, the, the little kid is like very gamer related. Like the, the Valentines he gave out for Valentines were like video game related. He's having it at a video game place. He, and I was like, all right, I think I know all I need to know. Because of course my son didn't. I was like, do you know anything he's into? He's like, no, I'm like, great, thanks, okay. You're in class with him, 40 hours a week. But anyway, okay. So we're just gonna add that. I ordered a bunch of stuff off of Amazon for him too. Then I got this, these two dry erase markers with the eraser, just for little man's big board that he has downstairs in the playroom. Then I got this for myself, I don't know why. <laughs> Because if you saw my last video, and I haven't tried the self-adhesive ones yet, but anyway. Uh, I can't wear regular lashes because one of my eyelids curves weirdly. It's a thing, whatever. But I thought this was super cool. So I was like, I just want to have it. So this is a lash glue liner. And I was like, well, that's pretty fantastic. If I could ever find, you know, find a way to wear them, I want that. Forgiving. Then I got these for Easter baskets. I got Peeps gummies, marshmallow flavored, three ounces. One definitely for little man's um, Easter basket, I think. Maybe one for my stepfather. I haven't decided yet, but in any case, I got two boxes. I also got this for little man's Easter basket. It is a Peeps Chupa Chup lollipop holder. The lollipop has little Peeps all over it and it is marshmallow flavored. And I thought that was so stinking cute. Then I got these two for little man's prize bag. These Zuru smashers, they're like his favorite thing ever. So those will go in the prize bag for when he spends all night in his bed. This is also for little man, little retractable eraser by Jot with two refills. I got it in gray, I thought it looked very sleek. I got this for me because I needed a new bronzer and this is Rimmel London Jelly Bronzer for $1.25. Sometimes I just get happy with Dollar Tree finds and this was one of them. Look how pretty. It's all holographic and stuff. Mm, I can't open it. Oh my gosh. Well, I can't open it to save my life. I think it's fused shut. I don't know what's happening. I need Brett to open that for me. I was gonna show you guys, sorry. Then I got this for me. This is uh, a volumizing mascara by Le Mercerie. Midnight Black. Then I got this by Be Pure, a glitter roller ball fragrance with glitter in it. They had strawberry and blueberry. And little man was with me and he's like, why are you getting strawberry? I said, cause it's a fragrance and I feel like it would be weird to smell like blueberries. I don't know why. 
I just do. This one smells cute. It's, oh, this one smells good. I might get the blueberry one just to see. This smells really sweet and I love it. That's cute. Throw that in your purse on the plane. Then I got this for myself. Oh, I think, did I get it for myself? I can't remember. This might be for um, my aunt in Greece also. I have to figure it out. But anyway, it's this little Le Mercerie, uh nude, smoky, shimmery. Actually, no, it's probably for me because it's shimmery. Yeah, okay. This little nude, smoky palette quad. Then I got a whole bunch of t-shirts and what have yous. So I found two of these for Brett, both in this green. But he loves these and, and tells me to keep an eye out for them when he details on the side, when he does the his car detailing business, like on weekends and in the summer and stuff. Um, the, he likes this, this material. I don't know. He says it's like his favorite. I don't know. So yeah, I found two of them. Very exciting. Then I got some stuff for Little Man. This says Simply Southern on the bottom tag. Made in Honduras, 100% cotton. This light blue long sleeve shirt. And then, if you watch me, if you're a permanent member of the Thrifty Divas family, you already know I have an obsession with neon. So I always get these for Little Man, and um, because they're light colored, they always get stained. So he needs some freshies for the summer. So I got him. However many I could find in his size, I got two, it looks like. Then I also have a huge thrift store haul to show you where I did get a bunch of summer clothes for him and I feel like some of them may require that neon. I'm not entirely sure though. And then I got him this too, this Hanes Beefy Tea made in Haiti, 100% cotton, and it's pink. Yes, real men wear pink. It's going to be awesome in the summer with a tan, with little black shorts. It's going to be adorable. So we'll bring that to Greece. Is that it? I guess. There might be more somewhere else. I feel like I felt like there was more. I could be wrong. And then we got this little Easter egg dispenser. Easter egg dispenser for a whole bunch of jelly beans, which I'll have to show you more because I got more bags in my car. So... I got the Jello ones because I was intrigued. I showed all the different varieties in the walkthrough, in the last walkthrough. My goodness. But I got this and I got like one more bag or something just to put in there. I got three of the Rice crispy Bunnies. So that's going to go to Brett. That's going to go to Little Man. And then, I don't know, my stepfather or me. I don't even know. But I got three. And then I also got two of the big mamma jammas. And that's probably going to be one for my mom, one for Brett, or one for little man. I don't know. I'm assuming you watched the walkthrough. But these are the giant half pound solid ones. Then little man was with me and begged, 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 begged me for this. So I'm probably just going to like, I don't know, either put it in his prize bag or hold it till his Easter basket. I'll probably put it in his prize bag. I don't know. And then if he doesn't get it by Easter, I'll put it in his Easter basket. But he wanted the Grow Pterodactyl, so we got it. I showed these in the walkthrough. They were the only pair I found. I could not find where they came from or what. But they are these clean earth made from rice husk fiber and recycled materials, stainless steel blade, lifetime warranty, blunt tip, these Westcott kids scissors. So I got those for little man. I also got this two pack of giant erasers for little man. His writing is not so good. That's why we need all these. And it says error and cancel. I thought that was cute. Hopefully they're good. I've never gotten them before. And then I got the little chicky Easter soap. And this one is, they used to say, they used to say, last time they had them, it said the scent. I don't see it. Anyway, whatever. Yeah. Then I got this for Little Man. This is Color Forms Grammar Wall Poster. We'll do it on the floor. 
Uh, it has nouns, verbs, pronouns, and adjectives. And then it's got all the little words that you stick in the different places. Perfect. It's exactly what he's doing right now. We got these, Sid the Science Kid. We got first grade addition and first grade subtraction, and they are also perfection. There's also going to be flashcards in here somewhere of the exact same thing. And then we got a bunch of books, and these are all perfect because Little Man can read them all himself. But I showed these in the walkthrough too. These are distributed by Greenbrier. I could only find these two. Bullying is and diversity is. So there was two more, belonging is and empathy is, but I couldn't find them. That's okay. These are good. And then I got him this, taking care of yourself. This is not distributed by Greenbrier. And this says sports, healthy diet, first aid, and more. So I got, um, I'm the mystery reader in his class the day after tomorrow, and I picked this up to read to them. Uh, it has to be 15 minutes. I have to give it a, a dry run, but I think it's about perfect. Sophia and the Purple Traveling Case. And it looks really cute. Sophia's Aunt Stella comes to visit the family every year with her purple traveling case. When Sophia's dad offers to carry the case up the stairs to Stella's guest room, she adamantly refuses his offer and lugs it up the stairs herself. No one knows what's in the suitcase, but everyone is curious. Join Sophia in discovering what's inside Aunt Stella's purple traveling case. And the illustrations are really cute. And last time I was a mystery reader, they're like, where's the pictures? So they really want to see the pictures. So it looks perfect. That's what that is for. Then I got a couple of books for Little Man to read to me. He also, he's doing a readathon um, that, we, that we're signing up for. I have to do it online where people are going to sponsor him and he has to read a whole bunch of stuff. So I thought... I'm just going to grab whatever books. So I thought this was cute. I thought he'd like it because it involves New York City. And that is his favorite place on earth. My boy. Uh, Tiana's Big City Sound. And it is completely good for him to read. And she's in New York City. Yeah. So over the winter break, we got a hotel. Brett, myself, and little man, we got a hotel. Uh, we went to dinner on Broadway. Little man went to his first Broadway show and it was, oh gosh, it was amazing. He, he absolutely loves it. So, all right, I digress. And then, and this is distributed by Green, Greenbrier guys, but it's Bendin. Encanto, Antonio's amazing gift. So that is for sure going into his uh, Easter basket probably or I might just save it for him to read for the for the readathon it's also his perfect level well actually no it's be way below his perfect level all right moving on so I showed these in the walkthrough we've seen the powdered sugar we saw the cinnamon dusted or whatever they were by these duchess and now they have chocolate frosted and we opened some the other night they're really good comparable to hostess I believe my opinion or en Entimans? Hostess. I think it's more hostessy. But yeah. Then I also showed these in the walkthrough. I just thought they were adorable. You get 12 in here. Made in the USA. Charms. Vanilla flavored lollipops with sprinkles. And let me see if I can show you one. Here. Can you see it? Yeah. They're white pops. Vanilla pops with rainbow sprinkles. They're so cute. All right, here's the other scent of the Autoban air freshener. This one is spring fresh, also 12 fluid ounces. And this, I think this smells more. It's like kind of minty, kind of soapy. I don't know. I liked it better. But that was after I bought the cherry ones. Then my Lady Hennessy's birthday is uh, sometime mid-March. So we usually celebrate on St. Patrick's Day since I have my parents here anyway. But I'm just gathering little gifts for her. So of course I got her this uh, pink cheetah print squeaky fluffy bone. And then I got her this flat giraffe print bone, which also has a squeaker in there and it's crinkly. Look, the sun. The Oni's filming. Quick, go. If you guys watch me, you know, it's a thing. It's just a thing. It happens every time. Here, uh, to go with the books that I showed you. Sid the Science Kid, Subtraction and Addition, Flashcards. And all it says is ages six plus. So 
two walkthroughs ago, I showed the display case of these. And of course it was empty and I was all sad, but then I found a display case that had some in it. These totally tiny, these like food blind bags. Well, then I found out there's only three kinds you can get and you actually get two things in there. I had to like read the box closer and all this. So I felt with my little fingers and I got all three of them. One is an egg and buttered toast. One is a heart shaped cookie and three macarons. And the other one is a taco and some churros. And I got them all because I like tiny foods. I don't know why. I just do. Then the little man wanted some of these for his his uh, prize bag. So we got four of these jungle in my pocket line bags. And that's everything you could get. I felt everything that was left. And I tried to get some different ones. But there was none of these. That's what he really wanted. I would have felt that tail and it was not there. But I got him four. Then I got these to add to my friend's package for her cat. These little Vitacraft Purr Sticks chicken recipe. And these are a product of Germany. Okay, the next item, I showed this in the walkthrough. This is the Contendina 15 ounce pizza sauce. And this one is in sweet tomato basil. There's a year left on this for the Best Buy. And I thought that was pretty good. Then I got this deli stick beef recipe for dogs by Molly's Market. This is gonna be another addition to Hennessy's birthday present. <laughs> and this is made in the USA. The next thing I picked up is another one of these little acrylic containers for my vanity. I have one already. I love it. I filled it with pink cotton balls. Can I just tell you story time with Theoni? So I have, when I bought it, the first one, I had mentioned, oh, I have colored, colored uh, cotton balls too. And I got so many comments. Everybody's like, what? Colored cotton balls? What are you talking about? And I was like, what? So I checked Amazon. Things for like crafting came up. But I was like, is it not a thing here? So anyway, what happened is I find them in Greece and I always pack my suitcase with them because they're fun. But I was like, hey, maybe, yeah, I didn't realize maybe it's like not a, a thing. So people had no idea what I was talking about. But anyway, so I filled the one. It's a mixed bag of baby pink, baby blue and yellow. Uh, but I, I pulled them all out and I, I did just blue in my bathroom. I have just pink on my vanity. <laughs> anyway. I use the pink, the yellow for my nail polish because nobody cares. I got another one. Um, I don't know. I'll put something in it. I just got it because I found myself regretting only getting one because I really like them. Okay. Next, I showed these in the walkthrough. I get disappointed by air fresheners on the regular. I don't know why I try, but we'll see. I mean, it's Glade. It's a name brand for smelly things. We'll see how it goes. I got the three pack of Hawaiian Breeze in the candle shape. They also had a four pack that smells like nothing of the leaf shaped and it was mixed with something vanilla and Hawaiian Breeze, but I got the three pack of the candle shaped ones. I hope they smell. It's like little tree or nothing for me, unfortunately. I can't find any good stuff. Then I got this one for Brett to try if they are good. This is warm leather four pack. We'll see. Then I got this to add to Little Man's Easter basket. It's an infinity cube. It does things like that. He'll like it. Then they had these Crayola number two pencils with the colored erasers in a bonus box, 10 plus two this time. So I got these just to uh, throw in his like school supply stash maybe for next year. Then I got two of these giant 25 ounce Safeguard hand soap. And they had a 25 ounce refill bottle as well. But I was like, let me just get one with the pump in case I want to go hard in the paint and put this whole thing by my sink. I don't know. Anyway, so yeah. 
One for me, one for my mom. I got this new lotion that I showed in the walkthrough to give a try for little man. This is new, Aquation. Hydrating daily lotion with ceramides, oatmeal, and aloe vera. It is fragrance-free, gentle, and hypoallergenic. No parabens, phthalates, or dyes. If you watch me, you know that's, that's how we say phthalates around here because I have no idea how to say it. And it's made in the USA, not tested on animals, woman-owned. So we'll give that a try for him. Then also speaking a little man, I got two boxes of these because this is the, um, with lotion. So I like to always have a couple boxes of these specifically for when he gets sick and blows his nose every three seconds. Cause then, oh, poor kid has such sensitive skin. That's why, anyway. The pain, the pain of what happens to his nose is worse than the sickness. So I always have to have the lotion ones around. I got two pink baby bottle brushes with the suction cup because it's pink. They had different colors. They had blue and yellow, but I got pink uh, for next to my sink because we do like to use these for um, water bottles and, you know, tumblers and what, what have you. So, yes. Then I got this. I've been seeing this at Dollar Tree for like 20 years, but story time with Dioni. This is Driver's Choice Auto Bucket. It looks like an ashtray to me. I got it as an ashtray. And let me tell you why. So my mom, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna say the make cause I don't wanna bash anybody's car. Um, my mom's car and she wanted me to get one. I was like, no, thank you, ma'am. I got my kind of car instead. Her, it is the most non- aerodynamic car I've ever seen in my life. When my mom and I go places or go on little day trips together or whatever it may be, just the two of us, don't get crazy. And I try to smoke a cigarette in the passenger seat. It is literally impossible, literally impossible. The ashes, they do not go out. They cannot go out. They end up all in my lap. I have a pile in my lap. The last time we took a little day trip together a couple weeks ago, she saw it. My mom's an ex ex smoker. She quit. A, she quit like when I started long, long time ago. But she saw what was going on. She's like, "Oh my goodness!" So she gave me. She had one of those little Dove lotion things. You know, they're like shaped like a hockey puck, and it was almost empty. So she gave it to me. She's like, "Use this as an ashtray." So I, we literally had to flick in the Dove lotion can. It's, it's crazy. I've never seen anything like it. Thank goodness I didn't get that car. Because I would have never known. I wasn't going to smoke a cigarette on the test drive. You know what I'm saying? So luckily, I didn't like the way it looked. And I didn't get it. So I got this. And the label is very annoying. It's going to come off. It's just very annoying. So I got this. I told her about it too. And she's like, oh, good. <laughs> so I got this to keep in her car for any time I smoke in the passenger seat. And I don't, you know, whatever. Fill it with water if you need to like put them out. But I don't know if I even necessarily need to put them out. I just need to ash is the biggest problem there. So this'll be good. And it fits in your cup holder. Never thought I would need one, but I we really need one. Okay, next, let me show you. I'm gonna make little goodie bags for little man's Greek class for right before Easter. It's actually going to be like almost two weeks before our Easter, but they don't have it right before our Easter. Anyway, so here's what I'm doing. We're doing, the bag is in there somewhere. I think it's, I'll get it. Later. I got these. I'm not too crazy about the other ones, but it was the brown one that really got me because it felt like chocolate to me. <laughs> anyway, so we got the Easter. There's only nine kids. And then I figured the rainbow ones we could keep for whenever. So that's great. So we got the pencil. I got one of these for each of the kids. This little Peeps dough set with the mold. So each kid will get one of those. We got a whole bunch of those. Whole bunch. And the, the bunny. Oh, no. The bunny part is always blue. But I got both uh, green and yellow. 
dough. Those are the only colors it came in. And then we got, of course, two packs would be eight. And then little man would not get a bag. <laughs> anyway, so I had to get three for one extra. But we're going to put one of those each in there. Greek school allows food. Public school does not. Then I got these. This is a 16 count. See, I might get one more for the one. Because it would be better to give them a full sheet. You know? But anyway, you cut it. So it's only half of this. So these are the really cool water. You just, you use this as a palette. You wet the brush. You wet this and then it paints. So I got those. I'm going to get another one. Let's do a full sheet. And then I got these because these were the cheapest brushes I could find. And I'll just end up doing these small ones probably. Two, four, five. Yeah, so there's 10 of just those. I'll hold on to the bigger ones and the bag for it all. There's this one. These little bags, you get 20. So that's for Greek school. Then I got these for little man uh, for his Easter basket. He loves stickers. So I got him this Jot 90 piece little animal one. He's gonna love that. And then I got him this one, which he's also gonna love, this 108 piece sticker. This is all dogs. Of course, they make up that amount with the little tiny paw prints. I got two packs of these that I showed in the walkthrough. Eight inch air fryer liners by every holder. That is so cool. Then I showed these in the walkthrough and I thought these were fantastic. I mean, I saw on Amazon a, a case of 12 for $30. So it's not that great, but anyway. But everywhere else I saw, there were much more than that. Um, so this is Zep Spirit 2, ready to use detergent and disinfectant. It is a fungicide, a mildestat, viricide, deodorizer, tuberculoside, Pretty, pretty good stuff here. So I got three of them. And they're big. They're a quart. Then I got one of these because little man wanted a dispenser in the downstairs bathroom for his mouthwash. <laughs> the little prince. So I said, we'll put his mouthwash in here and he can do it in his little cup and he's going to love it. So I picked the clear one because he uses the pink bubble gum one and he'll want to see it. I know, I know him. I made him. So we got the clear to show the pink. And then I showed these in the walkthrough as well. These Godinger Gatherings mug. I got this for my best friend because she is an Aquarius. And I thought it's so pretty. It's this like rose and blue marble with a rose gold accent and then the rose gold Aquarius symbol and it says Aquarius and it's a nice big size. Doesn't say the ounces anyway. Dishwasher and microwave safe. I don't believe any of that. I would not put that in the dishwasher, that's for sure. And then the microwave thing, I don't know. Maybe that's why they ended up at Dollar Tree. I don't know. I wouldn't, that's just me. So yeah, I think she's gonna love that. And she's a big tea drinker. So you pair that with a little tea assortment I got I showed these in the walkthrough I only showed one flavor I showed like a pineapple coconut I didn't I had no interest in that but they have this Tremino protein infused water 28 calories zero carbs seven grams of protein for a bottle it's nothing crazy but it's seven grams of protein and I got a couple of the peach because that sounded good and then I got a couple of the orchard, which is apple pear. So that sounded delicious as well. And it has um, seven grams of whey protein, essential amino acids, and 100% of the recommended daily amount of B3, B5, B6, and B12 in a water. So got two each of those for me. Then I got these for Brett. 
These are zero sugar sparkling ice caffeine. And they only had strawberry citrus. So I just got two of them for him. Zero sugar, five calories, zero carbs, so a few vitamins. And let's see where it gets its caffeine from. Green tea extract. Not bad. So yeah, he likes all these things because as we always say, he drives around other people's children at like the butt crack of dawn. So I got myself these sunglasses. I don't know why. They just, they were cute. <laughs> they're like pilot's glasses, but they're like a brick, brick color. And they're plastic. They're all plastic. So I was like, beach, yes. I can, I can picture it. Can you, you getting it? Yeah. So I thought those were fun. Then I showed these in the walkthrough. These Bakerfield ready to decorate cookie, Bakersfield ready to decorate cookies. They, now they have Easter cookies. So I hope they're not broken. We got the bunny and we got the egg. So little man had a blast doing the, I, brought, I bought three gingerbread men for Christmas and he had such a fun time. He did it Christmas Eve morning. And I just let him go to town and make a mess and have fun and get creative. So we'll do that again. Then I got these. I also showed these in the walkthrough. These are Pete the Cat reward stickers, 135 of them. So you got the 15 sheets of nine there. And I'm actually giving these to his Greek school teacher because she gives out, she has a sticker system for rewards. So I give her stickers. I got this to add to somebody's basket. I think Brett. Not my jam, so I'm definitely not eating this one. This is the Fruity Pebbles one. It's white chocolate with Fruity Pebbles in it. And then I got Now and Later Jelly Beans. So what did I get before? The Now and Later Jelly Beans and the Jello ones, I think. So I think that's the only two I got. And we'll put that in our little egg dispenser. Then they had these. They had one I did not get, too. We'll talk about it in a minute. But these little EAD sets... And they smell really good. <laughs> I smelt them all. Oh no, what is that? Okay. I will be returning this one and getting another one because I really liked it. I hope they still have it. This one is Compared to Island Kiss by Escada. And it comes with a little spray perfume and a lotion, but something happened and this whole bottle of perfume is empty. So I got to find my receipt in here and I want to switch that out. I want to, I never return things, but I really like it. And yeah. This is the receipt for that. Okay. Hey, future Theone here. I just wanted to jump in to tell you I did in fact return it and get another one and it is absolutely amazing. I love this smell. I was looking for the real perfume and uh, yeah, I'm gonna get that too. But the reason why I'm here, while I went to go do that, I found in a different section, gifts for him. All the ones I got are gifts for her. They had... Uh, Something by Azaro. I don't remember what it was called, but it wanted, I think, but it did not smell. I didn't like it. But they had this, which is uh, compared to Hugo by Hugo Boss. And this one smells good. The men's ones are a bath gel and the cologne. So that is super cool. Shower gel. And the female ones are a lotion with the perfume. And then I got compared to CK1. And we all know, if you remember when CK1 first came out, it is the unisex, right? One cent for everyone. It's the unisex scent. So I also got myself one too. So I got one for Brett in the CK1, one for me. And then I got him the Hulk. And uh, they come with shower gels. And they're amazing. I love these things. Okay, back to the video. And then the other two I got smell so good. This one is compared to Bombshell in Bloom, Victoria's Secret. And it's got the lotion and the little spray perfume. And then this one is Undercover Angel. 
which is Dream Angels Heavenly by Victoria's Secret. They smell so good. And they are cute little spray bottles for travel. You can fly with them and all of that. But that one, that Island Kiss by Escada dupe, I, it's my favorite one. So the fourth one that they had was Japanese Cherry Blossom by Bath and Body Works. Why? That one made no sense to me, so I didn't get that one. Then I already gave a few of these to my stepfather. Why is this one loose and the rest are not? So these are Best Buy October 2024. They're half a pound. And this is Nature's Goodness Organic Coconut Flour. Keto-friendly, gluten-free, wheat-free, dairy-free, kosher, preservative-free, non-GMO. It's got three grams of protein. It's got six grams of fiber, nine total carbs, but six grams of fiber, one total sugar. Absolutely amazing. Organic coconut flour. Then I got one of these by Aromar. This is a uh, room mist, and this one is Royal Linens, made in the USA. It smells just like laundry. And then, my favorite scent of all time, I got three more of the Oatmeal and Almond Luminescence Spray, two fluid ounces. I am obsessed with this smell. Now I got the idea from somebody in my comments who said that they bought a whole bunch of them and put them into a bigger spray bottle so that they could spray it. I got this. This is a new spray bottle, by the way. So this is like the rose gold and instead of the pump, like the Windex pump, it's this now. This one. I feel like that's better. So yeah, I'm pouring these into this. This doesn't have an ounces, so I won't know how many will fit in here. It looks pretty big though. I'm assuming maybe six, but I love this smell so much. I just love it. I love it. I've, I've sprayed it on myself before. I have, I've sprayed it like on my jacket. It doesn't stain, it's not for me. Test, test, test it for you. Didn't stain. I just love the smell so much. It's amazing. So I'm gonna make myself a big bottle and then I got some more movies. There might be more movies in another bag too, I think. So I got Eddie Murphy, Coming to America on DVD. I don't own it, now I do. And then I got this to put in Little Man's Easter Basket. This Super 4 inspired by Playmobil. It's a 90 minute runtime. Probably bring that to Greece with us too, because I have that region free DVD player there. So I just thought it was fun. And for myself and Brett, now when Brett and I go away, uh, first week in April, I told him one of the things I'm most excited about. I got a suite so that we could have a couch and, it's, and we got a little mini fridge and a microwave. I said, one of the things I'm most excited about is spending two or three days, spending all night watching scary movies and eating snacks on uninterrupted. Oh my gosh. Hashtag mom life. So this is one of the ones I got for fun. It looks pretty bad, but that's okay. Uh, 88 minutes, so you're not wasting too much time. It's called Investigation 13. Such unspeakable things happened here. I'm excited. All right, there's an end in sight, guys. This bag is not it, but it, there's an end in sight. Okay, then... Oh, I got these button batteries, these uh, 2032s. I think that's the one I needed. I hope it's the one I needed. And I couldn't resist. I got a Cody Airspun highlighter. I got the darker one. I don't know. I like the dark ones. And then I also got this for myself. The same brand, the La Mercerie. This is a uh, matte finish setting spray. Perfect for travel. And I got this Care US reversible tough wrap. Durable hold designed to stick to self, not to your skin. Um, directions for use. Thoroughly clean and dry wound. Cover area of wound with 
the tough rap uh wrap with the tough wrap to secure the gauze pad in place be sure to overlap the tape and gently press onto the underlying all right so that's good i just like especially with kids and dogs this is you need this then i got four of these i already gave two to my mom centrum energy and vitality vitamins with coq10 and b vitamins 50 capsules and this is uh good until the end of april so that's why it's cheap but so 50 caplets and the serving is two so you got two months here march eight you're good like now you're good you know then i got these for me these softy I got the Silken Shea Shampoo, 12 and a half fluid ounces. And then we got the Argan Glow Conditioner. Man, those smell good. Conditioner smells better, but yeah. Then I got this for little man. We had to try on like 10 belts in the store. Little chunker monk. Uh, so that says retail $16. This is a Canterbury, and this is a reversible, size 24. Reversible brown and black. That's the brown, that's the black. And it's got a, like a brushed nickel buckle. But yeah, $1.25, he does not own a belt. Now he does. Then I got this water, this is Zen water. Um, this is 100% recycled from ocean-bound plastic. This is a 9.5 pH, so it's alkaline water. I don't know. It's almost 34 fluid ounces. Then I got six of these. I bought half the case. I gave three to my stepfather already. This is Super Cold Brew. This is the Black Unsweetened. So this is awesome. My stepfather loves black coffee. So this is, that's why I bought these for him. But then I figured you could add your own sweetener, your own creamer, if you haven't, you know, any of your dietary restrictions. So I thought that was great. So I got those unsweetened black super coffees. Then I only found one of these and I showed it in the walkthrough and I bought it. This is the Peeps Lollipop Rings. Two yellow and one pink is what you get. It tells you there. Why they show a blue, I'll never know. And I bet you little man's going to be pissed off about that. Because <laughs> he's going to say it shows a blue one. And he's not wrong. So anyway, you get three in there. Wait, what? Contains two yellow, one pink. Four lollipop rings is one of, I don't know what's happening. The math ain't mathin'. We're just gonna leave that alone. But so cute, ring pops, but peeps, and marshmallow flavored made in Mexico. That goes in the Easter basket. Little man was with me, requested some iced animal crackers. We got them, made in the USA. Then I showed these in the walkthrough. I just got one because something was telling me I, they might pop up in another flavor. So I didn't want to get two or anything of this just in case. But I got one of these Betty Crocker muffin tops in blueberry. And if you saw the walkthrough, I was wondering how it turns out to be just the top. Um, you drop it onto a pan like a cookie. So you need a quarter cup of water, a quarter cup of vegetable oil, and one egg. And then I got a box of strawberry cake because I saw a, a recipe that I actually want to try. So we got that. Uh, but I need strawberry jello powder for it, which Dollar Tree did not have. And then I got a banana cream instant jello because I don't know. I was like, I'm going to make a banana cream pie. However, they didn't have Nilla wafers because I needed them. And that's the way everything works at Dollar Tree. They have it all the time, unless you need it, then it's not there. So whatever, I got butter rings. Now, if you watched my uh, Christmas treats, I made the Greek salame, which um, usually calls for like a digestive, like a more dense biscuit. Uh, but I ended up using these and I was pleasantly surprised that they did not get soft. 
in a log of butter in the fridge. They did not get sore. So I think these will be fine instead of uh, Nilla wafers. Flavor's different, but whatever. My family won't care. And then I got the vanilla cream little Dutch maids for the strawberry cake thing. You're supposed to use golden Oreos. Good enough, I say. All right, then these were a repurchase because I lucked out and found more of it at a different store. These are Gildan Smart Basics, $6 price tag on there. Boys sweatpants. So I got two more. These are just classic sweatpants, elastic bottom, elastic top. Yeah. You know, standard sweatpant. I got two more for little man. Then I got these from my cousin. If you watched my Timu haul and I got her the mushroom t-shirt, I said I got one of my, and one of my cousins is into mushrooms lately. Not those kind. Uh, and she forages and stuff. I don't know. Anyway, I thought these were adorable. She doesn't have a fairy garden, but she could stand them up on a shelf. I thought they were so cute. So I got her these big ones and then these little bitty ones. They're adorable. Way back, <laughs> I had gotten little man his like, turquoise one and I was like oh I should have gotten a pink one for myself I love it I love the pink and I said I'll probably get it and I finally found another one it was actually harder than I thought it would be so I got this for travel to put stuff in like whether it be earrings or they're so loud whether it be earrings or anything make a little first aid kit I don't know I just love it so I, I got myself a pink one yes and it will not be for food in any way shape or form then two more things for Hennessy's birthday. They had these little, they look like the snuggle bear. They're so cute. Crinkly and squeaky they are. I think they had a third color also, like a medium brown, but it, I didn't like it. So I got these two for her. And then I showed these two walkthroughs ago, this little mini stacking three planter thing like that. I thought that was so cute. Oh my goodness. I don't even know. I'll probably give it to my mom in like her, her Easter basket or something. She'll do something there. Then I got this for my aunt in Greece, this lavender cuticle oil pen by Be Pure. I got the mango one. I gave it to my mom. She loved it. Then I got, I was, I was contemplating getting the other color of these, but anyway, I got the folding sunglasses. I got for me, for Brett, and I already gave a pair to my stepfather for their trip in uh, the what they, in a couple weeks. And the case, folding sunglasses. They just they just look like wayfarers, kind of to me, I think. And then the case, perfect, perfect, perfect. You don't have to worry about them breaking because they fold. I love it. And then I got myself these because I realized I don't know where all my brushes are while I was doing my uh, Valentine's uh, DIYs and the money cake. If you missed that video, you could go check it out. Wow, this looks terrible. That looks horrible. But anyway, I got myself these two packs. And then I found this garlic and herb kinders, kinders, whatever. And then I had... Before that, I got like a big one of something. I don't even remember what it was. Seafood? I think it was seafood seasoning. And then I'm a crazy person and I don't have the receipt, so I don't know how I'm going to do that. But anyway, for my walk-in closet, on the shelf on the top that we built, I bought the round white like ribbed bins with the little handles on top. I got all white ones. First, I had all multicolored ones because I couldn't find them. Then I found all white ones at a store. So I bought all the white ones. I returned all the colored ones. So now I have all white ones. At least they match. Then I even took my label maker out and I put labels on them. Then I found these, these oval, like dusty rose, big ones. And I fell in love. <sighs> and then I was like, maybe I could return the white ones. Well, no, the receipt for this says like oval bin. I'm like, that's not the same thing. I can't return it. So uh, now I'm, earmuffs screwed and uh I don't know but I love them and I'll put the labels on here and it matches my carpet and my curtains and my everything so I had to have them 
we're almost there guys almost like really there's like three little things i gotta show you well this is one so all right i got some more movies i told you there was more look at this i had to have this i'm sure little man will enjoy it but i had to have this this is nickelodeon the rugrats movie and hey arnold the movie what so yes i own this now then I got this. I'm pretty sure Brett and I saw this. I think we got it from Redbox once, but I don't know. Boyhood. Where the, like, the documentary maker actually, like, follows the same guy for 12 years or something. Something crazy, but yeah. I feel I feel like I, we did see it. I can't really remember. Brett's better at that than me. I, don't, I have these strange mental blank spots where I can't remember the movies. I've, I've like rented the same movie twice and Brad will be like, we saw that. And I'm like, oh, like, yeah, I don't know. It's weird. Anyway, then I got Paranormal Activity 3 on Blu-ray. That's my thing. Brett hates them, but I, I don't know. Whatever. Oh, and this is a combo pack. It's got Blu-ray and DVD. So if you don't have a Blu-ray player, you're still fine. Then, again, our scary little weekend getaway. I got Phobias. Looks like another cheesy horror movie. And The Conjuring 2. Because I told you last time we're a big fan of all the Conjuring movies and all that. And I found Annabelle Creation on Blu-ray at Dollar Tree. This was like a week or two ago. And now I found The Conjuring 2. So Brett loves them. That's like the one horror movie he's all in on. Then I had purchased one each of these before and then I ran to the store again and I got, I think, four of each this time because they're delicious. They're loaded with sugar, though. Loaded. Uh, 30 grams of sugar. Oh, my goodness. Ugh, and this one's 34. So these Lady Boba bubble teas. This one is brown sugar bubble tea. This one is taro bubble tea. But I was like, oh my goodness, when I had one, I, I haven't, I haven't had this one yet. Is that, that looks like that actually is maybe taro chunks in there as well as the bubbles. But, um, I, I have like bubble tea straws and all that stuff. So I was like, oh, I want to have this and be able to offer it, especially to my stepfather who loves a good bubble tea when he comes over. So I got four of each. They're fantastic. And the very last thing in still what I think is a giant haul. I have no clue. I haven't edited yet. I have no idea how long this is. Anyway, these, I thought this was good. 26 fluid ounces, 100% recycled bottle. And uh, it's the refill for the multi-surface disinfectant cleaner. Kills 99.9% .9 of germs. Yeah, pretty good. And it's citrus scent. That's it. Thank you for hanging out with me for your entire day. I think. It feels like. I don't know. I have to go pick up little man from school. I can't even put this stuff away. But at least I got it filmed. So I'm getting there. And now I have a giant thrift store haul to film for you. I'm get all that stuff where it needs to go. And I'll be kind of caught up. Uh, life is just insane, as always. But anyway... Thank you again for hanging out with me. If you have not yet hit that subscribe button already, I would love if you would consider doing so and becoming a permanent part of the Thrifty Divas family. We would love to have you. We tend to have a lot of fun here. Also, don't forget, give a little thumbs up, leave a little comment. YouTube loves that stuff, helps the algorithm. They tell other people, hey, watch this channel. People like it and all that stuff. There's also, never have to do it. I'm just bringing it up. There's a little thank you heart in there. If you ever want to leave a monetary donation, that's what it's for if you've ever seen it and don't know. And I forgot, when you hit the thumbs up, you get a little party explosion, which I love telling you. All right, that's it. I'm going to go. I'm going to go get little man. I hope you guys enjoyed this. And uh, yeah, we're all caught up for now. Until the next one, stay blessed, my friends. I love each and every one of you. Mm -hmm.